Okay, this is my multi FX board where it has all the FX games on one adapter board. So, here's what it looks like it has these switches over here. This switch controls which ROM is selected. And there's three games on each ROM. And this switch here selects which game, you know, of the three from the three ROMs. And so this was actually a Doom game cartridge that uh, started out life as. And so and I added this battery save circuit board. And then there's a, another SRAM that's all smaller. And this all solders right in place of where the original SRAM used to be. And then this this adapter here solders where the mask ROM used to be. And I'm flipping it over, and it, this ROM board connects through this connector here. And so, sorry. So here's a picture of the ROM board, not connected, not attached, and. Um, and it just plugs in right there on my on my host cartridge. So I'm just gonna plug it in. Sorry for the crazy video. Okay, so there it's, it's reattached. And all fits nice and neat. Now this one switch here lower has to be flush because uh, if it sticks out it'll catch It'll catch the um, the side of the console. So I'm gonna just plug this in, turn this on. Yoshi's my first game of the group. Here's Yoshi's Island. And be with that uh, SRAM board and battery save board, it allows me to have separate save banks for each game that saves. So the Yoshi's Island saves will remain even uh, if you switch over to Star Fox 2 or, or whatever. They all have their own separate save banks. So now I'm just going to flip to game number 2. Hit reset. Now I'm in Star Fox 2. Switch again, reset, and then it's just regular Star Fox. So that's on the first ROM, and then on the second ROM, just need to flip that switch there. Okay, so on the second ROM, I've got uh, Winter Gold, which is normally a European game. It's actually quite fun. And, um, of course, it was modified to work on the uh, NTSC system. All right, so game number two is, uh, I think, Stunt Race. Yep. So, game number three on the second ROM is oh, Star Fox Competition. And then I'm going to switch to the third ROM. Hit reset. Now this is Doom. The host cartridge for this setup. I'm on the third ROM and I'm on the second game selection. This is uh, Vortex. All right, and then the third game, third and last game on the on the third ROM. Hit 
preset. These dirt tracks. So that's my multi FX cartridge. It all fits neatly inside. The games are all selected by these two switches. And for a little more fun, I have my uh, two Yoshis in one. And it's just selectable by that little jumper there. So this is a real simple um, a real simple two-in-one Yoshi. So this one is um, the new Super Mario 2 Yoshi's Island. Okay. And then I move my little jumper over to the other side, power, now this is Golden Yoshi Returns, how about that? Thank you 2010 Jacob for doing this great, ha great hack, I've had a lot of fun playing it. Okay, but that's not where it ends. This is my multi Yoshi cartridge. It has these, all these Yoshi uh, Island versions, all in um, one cartridge. So let's see here. So here is the first one. Made by Golden Yoshi. Thank you again. So this is the Super Mario World 2 Plus. Okay. And if we uh, switch to game number two. This is Super Mario World 2 Plus 2. Okay. Now we go to the next ROM, and then this one is the new Super Mario World 2. I'm going to flip the switch again. And this is the Golden Yoshi Returns. And last but not least, is, now the title doesn't say it, but this is called Forlorn Lands. And it's, um, it's another Yoshi's Island hack. Uh, and then there's one other hack that I didn't show, which is called Kmix Revenge 2.0. But this uh, Forlorn Lands, I think I'm pronouncing that correctly, is um, sorry. This is, um, if you'll notice, you know. It, even though the title wasn't changed, it's um, it is different. Yes, I know it's hard to play with one hand. Anyways, you get the idea. It's uh, it's not the original. It's uh, anyway. That one was called Forlorn Lands, and uh, whoever did it did a really good job with the hack. All right. Well, that's it. That was my uh, multi FX board. Has all the FX games on it. 
along with my uh, multi Yoshi board that's got all the Yoshi hacks on it except for one. Um, I could put the sixth one on. There is room in the ROMs, but it would mess up uh, uh, one of the save files. I think I'm not I'm not entirely sure about that now because I think they um, uh, you could actually. Uh, play one game and use the same save file to get to that same uh, world and level on a different hack. I think the save files uh, or architecture is basically the same between them. And then of course this is just the two-in-one um, cartridge where you just move the little jumper over. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed it.